Once you've registered at Ancestry.co.uk, you'll want to start searching for your ancestors in our records. The navigation bar across the top of the screen enables you to get around the site. Roll your mouse over the different tabs without clicking on them, and options appear for each one below the tab. So if you want to look for an ancestor in the census documents, point your mouse to search and then move it down to census and electoral rolls. Click and you'll come to a screen where you can perform a search of these records. Whenever you want to go back to the main screen, just click home at the top left. If you've set up one or more family trees using our site, you can access them directly from the family trees box on the main screen. Just click on the tree you want to view and you can continue building your tree and updating information about the individuals in it. Watch our in-depth tutorial on family trees to find out more. The What's Happening at Ancestry box will alert you to new records that we've uploaded. And if you scroll down, there are boxes for Member Connect, Our Record Collections, and Your Shoe Box. You can customise the main screen to look the way you want it to by clicking on Customise Your Homepage at the top right. Use the arrow buttons at the top right of any box to move its location up or down on your homepage. Or click the rubbish bin to eliminate the ones that you don't use. Then click Exit at the top right to go back to the screen itself. All your changes will be implemented. If you need to make changes to your Ancestry.co.uk account, roll your cursor over the My Account link at the top right. A drop-down menu will appear giving you various options. Here you can set your user profile, change details like your email address, or upgrade your account to gain access to more of our records. For more on My Account, Watch the in-depth tutorial about this area of the site.